Should you quit your job? Hell yeah. You should absolutely quit that fucking thing, and I'm about to tell you why. So I'm going to tell you a story about the first couple places that I worked. The first place I was working at a restaurant, and it was blatantly obvious that I was smarter than the people who own the restaurant. Every single day, I would try to input new systems. I was managing the place. I would try to input new systems, and they just wanted to keep it the way it was. And I could not fucking handle it. I was serving pizza, serving fucking sodas to fat people, and I just thought, what the fuck? am I doing? So from there, I went and I got my real estate license because there was a low barrier to entry. Take a class, pass a test, and I can do that shit, right? So I started out as a, as a buyer's agent on this team, and I was like, fuck, I cannot be here. And because of that, I went to help this dude who asked me to come help him run his company. This guy's name was a and a was a fucking sociopath, psychopath, actually later got arrested for calling in a bomb threat to a school. True story. But this guy was an absolute nutcase. And from then, I put my foot down. I said, I am absolutely not working for anyone else. And from there, I straight up burned the boats, quit my job, no income, started a business. Figured it the fuck out. So I want you to ask yourself, do any of those situations that I just mentioned resonate with you? Are you feeling fucking stuck? at some dead-end job where you go home, feel dead inside, probably yell at your girlfriend over some stupid shit, or are you feeling energized and fucking fulfilled by your job? That is what you have to ask yourself. Are you wasting valuable time on this planet? See, every single day I wake up, dude, I could pull out of my driveway and get fucking smoked by some truck and not make it. I want to wake up and do exactly what I want to do every single day, and guess what? You can do that shit too. If you follow the steps to the proven system that I lay out for every young entrepreneur on the planet. Are you showing up at your job every single day saying, what the fuck am I doing here? Because that was me. I said that every goddamn day and I would fucking die inside. On the way home, red light, I would spin out. Over any little thing, I would get pissed as fuck. And then I'd come home and my girlfriend at the time, who's now my wife, she'd be being nice, doing some nice shit for me and I would be a dick. And guess what? It was because I hated my fucking position in where I was. And because of that, I had to create my own circumstance. Now, you have two options if this is you. Number one, burn the fucking boats. This is what I did. I said, fuck it. I do not care about anything. I am going to do whatever it takes to succeed on my own. And I did it. I quit my job, no income, and fucking figured it out. Now, this may seem a little bit radical to some of you, a little bit fucking crazy, because guess what? It fucking is. Now, you might say, Brody, I'm not totally fucking insane. That's okay. Option number two, save up four to six months of expenses. Here's how you do this, because most people are living paycheck to paycheck, spending that on bills, living expenses, whatever it may be. Here's what you do. Sell every fucking thing in your house. Sell your goddamn couch. The couch is where people get comfortable. You need to be getting uncomfortable. I'm getting uncomfortable every fucking day, and that's why I grow, and that's why I have results. If you sell everything in your house except for your goddamn bed, your laptop, and your phone, you will have enough to go out on your own and survive. Period. But most individuals are not willing to do one of those two things. So if you're not willing to do one of those two things and you hate your fucking job and feel dead inside, get used to it. But if you really want change in your life, you really want results, you can have them. Every single person can have them. I'm not special. I'm not that talented. I'm not that smart. I'm not that fucking good looking. Like, I'm just a normal fucking guy who said, hey, I'm going to take action and do whatever it takes to win. And if you do that, if you do that simple thing, burn the boats or sell all the shit in your house, you can make it happen.